Hey guys, it's Adam, aka Swimming Bird, and we are back for a mod spotlight. But this is a very special one because it's not necessarily a mod, but it is a tool to make mods for Minecraft. A very easy one, in fact. Now, this is M Creator, or MC Creator, whatever you want to call it. It's by this team named Pilo, and it allows you to very easily make mods for Minecraft to mod different blocks and items and stuff and I will show you exactly what I'm talking about here. Now down here I've created a little game. The rules are still uh, not hammered out too much. I'm just doing a little test here, but I can show you. I used the uh, M Creator uh, program to make a mod of diamond ore called Boom Diamond. Now <laughs> I just basically wanted to make a type of diamond that was very easy to break and would cause a huge explosion. So uh, I, I did that. <laughs> now this is a grid I made, and the game might involve walking across to try to get to the emerald, and each block you step on you have to break. But eventually it's kind of like Minesweeper, where there are some, a couple boom dynamites spread throughout this whole thing of diamond. So I'm going to show you how this works here, and we're going to get started. But the program is, it uh, uses JavaScript, but you don't have to know any Java programming to do this. It's very easy once you get it running. It's a little tricky to get going. Uh, you have to download a few things, but you can mod a lot of other stuff. I can Before I show you this, I can also show you that I tried to uh, edit some armor to make what I was calling Blast Chainmail. It was just going to be a more resilient chainmail for this game. But as you can see, I, I messed up on the texture a little here because... Uh, that creepy sound happened right when I turned into the, the creepy uh, white version of me. I look like a snowman or something. But anyways, I think that's just the texture being messed up. But it is a more resilient chainmail. I think it just has diamond qualities. But you can do other stuff like food. I think it lets you edit almost everything but mobs. But without further ado, let's play Boom Diamond. And I'm just going to kind of walk through here and break diamonds as I go. And we'll see if I hit one of the wrong ones here. We'll know instantly we're doing good so if this were the game I would make this a lot bigger because it would take it wouldn't take too many to get to the emerald or I would put more boom diamonds in here but yeah I'm just using creative it'll break uh, almost instantly regardless if you're on survival or creative well and there we go <laughs> and we hit the boom diamond and look at all that diamond ore exploded into all this experience tons of diamond so when I tested this originally, I set the radius to 10, and then I bumped it up to 20 before I started recording, and I didn't test it. So <laughs> 20 took out this whole thing. You could probably get pretty crazy. But yeah, as soon as you tap it, basically, it takes a second when you're actually picking it, but as soon as you tap it in creative, it blows up. <laughs> and there we go. So that's, that's Boom Diamond. I can do another test here. Let's just try what see what happens when I mine boom diamond in survival I can change my game mode but yeah this is just one of the this is the first thing I thought of it's one of the many cool things you can do with M creator and and it's getting updated a lot like you, they've just released it recently but it looks like they're kind of passionate about this project and trying to uh, get people to use it so give it a try if you have a little time on your hands to set it up let's try mining it Oh, <laughs> and it killed me. <laughs> so, yeah, mining it uh, takes... I tried to make it so that it would explode like before you could realize that you're mining the wrong type of block. But anyways, that's uh, that's M Creator. Give it a try, guys. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed my little game and have some suggestions on how the, ru the rules for Boom Diamond should work. And I'll keep messing with it and come back when I've modded some, like, food and items and all that stuff. Maybe I'll make a sword that can, like, hit things from really far away or something. I don't know. I'm trying to think of some other mod ideas. Post your suggestions in the comments, because I want to figure out, if, if, you don't, if you guys don't want to test it, just give me ideas and I can try it out and then I'll make videos about it. So, thanks for watching, guys. It was a lot of fun messing with that. Hope you enjoyed. Goodbye. All right, just a quick little uh, bonus footage here. <laughs> I was messing with biome generation, and I made this strange biome with these emerald TNT trees, just a bunch of flowers on dirt, and then underneath that is like mossy cobble and stuff. It's a very strange biome. And if we, when I was testing it, there was some surface lava that set these trees off, but I don't know if we'll get lucky this time with that. 
but yeah, <laughs> so some of the stuff he can do with this is pretty crazy. I mean, I know this is stuff that modders have been doing for a bit, but it's nice to be able to do this without having any programming experience. So pretty cool. It lets you choose a lot of different stuff. So have fun messing with it, guys, and don't forget to leave me some suggestions to try out. I will see you guys later. Goodbye. Thank you.